In May 1942, a strange group of mobsters, lawyers, and intelligence officers headed for the Danamora prison, Little Siberia. Moses Polakov was there as Luciano's attorney. He walked into Lucky and he says, what the hell are you guys doing here? He was really surprised. Polakov has never fully disclosed the details of that meeting, but Luciano came to a decision. We explained to him up the purpose of our mission, and he said, yes, I'll help. With Luciano's blessing, word went out that the mob wanted the Dockers to pull together to help the war effort. The Mafia's message was clear. No more ships are to be burned. The order was obeyed completely. By then, Lucky Luciano had been moved from Little Siberia to Great Meadow Prison, one of the easiest going institutions in the US penal system. From the point at which the Mafia pledged their help to the US government, there were no more incidents on the waterfront and no workers strikes. The docks ran smoothly for the duration of the war. US Navy intelligence was now committed to working with public enemy number one. One of their leading officers, Anthony Maslow, recalled. Anyone who can make a contribution to help us was used whether it was Luciano, whether it was Bugsy Siegel, whether it was Costello, whether it was Maya Lansky, yes. Habes Willman, yes. Mike Lascari, yes. All of them. But the relationship between the mob and the government didn't end in New York. In 